getting back into it we are finally in the month of august this is the sketchbook from said month uh we are finally into the last third of 2017 uh it genuinely feels like january was just around the corner and i just started doing this sketch a day type scenario so without further ado uh, if you're following these videos, I'm sure you know the Hundreds Gang that I try to uh, associate with and uh, share most of their stuff. But, speaking of which, we started the month off with this picture from Jan. Um, he was taking the month of August off of social media to hammer out some comic details, work on all his other art stuff and whatnot. But as a parting gift for the month, he uh, sent me this photo because this is a photo he was using from his own hands to work on hand studies. Uh, I really like the detail in the different hands. Um, the stuff he had in the background turned out really nice. Um, there are some angles that are kind of wonky on it. If looking at the original picture but for what it's worth I really enjoyed making that little hand study of Jan's Hans. Uh, for the second day we have this car study the magnificent GTO rolling down this country road. Uh, it's hard to get different colors with just the color blue. Um, if you remember from the previous month I was doing red and blue and it was kind of muddying everything up so I decided to do away with that. And this is what we're left with. Um, you have this location. Uh, I've been working on doing a lot more grand scale, um, but trying to get them small so I can get small details in there. Um, I think that's a big hurdle I have yet to get over, um, is just making things smaller than I want to. I have a big problem with making things bigger than they already are, um, and then the proportions not lining up just quite well. Uh, I do like this grand hallway. Uh, it's probably going to be a setting for something down the road. Um, going into this, uh, I really enjoy this portrait study. Um, the hands kind of wonky there, um, but I like the different ways the walls come together behind her. Um, I'm trying to work on hair a little bit more, get that worked out so it looks a lot better. Another car study, popped hood. Uh, the really you'll see this later in the month, but this really confusing thing of the popped hood giving a different plane than this quote unquote box the car is in, uh, just kind of hard to deal with. Uh, you have this kind of sewer scene, um, trying to give this feel of coming up from the manhole and the sewer stretching in the back like left a bunch of notes by myself but I really like how that turned out uh, one of my friends I've met on social media she's a model uh, loves comics too um, tried I really like this figure, figure study because of these staircase I don't know it's something about staircases lately but uh, I really like this dress she was wearing tried getting some finer details uh, doing a bigger cut shot of her uh, for the next one. Had this Aztec feel like uh, cosplay. Uh, I wanted to do one of the bigger ones, but I kind of messed up the proportions, so kind of worked with that. At that point, didn't have enough to do the whole thing, so I just went and did her face study after that. Spent 20 minutes on it. Um, this is a cartoon sketch of this windy road um there's small details that i want to fix but spent a fair amount of time on it uh makani terror is back uh i really like how this turned out i uh, went back refined a lot of it um but yeah i really like how that turned out my self portrait for the month is me holding a bottle in front of my face <laughs> i'm running out of selfies to do for my self portraits uh, it's going to be one, uh, I wonder if I can make it through the end of the year with this. I really like how this turned out. I'm getting a lot of the 
facial features down better. Uh, once again, you got Makani Terror. Uh, in this hot rod she did shoot for, I think I've drawn a few more pictures from it in these sketchbooks. Uh, you have this picture of this El Camino on the drag strip. Uh, this El Camino is called Kamikaze, one of my favorites. Um, just an awesome piece. I really like how it came together. You have that uh, wall that stretches all the way from behind the car. You have this bank vault and like this pool area. Uh, I just really love all the different uh, walls and the little details that I had to put into that. Really turned out pretty great. Um, this, the tires. The tires are really wonky on this. Um, kind of threw me off doing this charger. It looks much more like a, a Mustang than a charger. So it kind of just <laughs> upsets me more than anything to look at that picture. Um, I think this point is when I'm like, you know what? I think I can start getting quicker at these. And I think I really uh, bit down and tried doing these uh, within 10 minutes every, every day then. Uh, you have this pinup model with blowtorch um, digging of the designs in the back. Um, you have this first attempt. I really hated that attempt. Like, I was like, no, I'll calm down. I'll make it better. I uh, came back, uh, did this a lot better. I love this one a lot more. Spent five more minutes on it. Uh, got all those touches refined. Uh, you have this figure study at the bottom. I really like how that turned out. Um, then I had a family reunion, so I was just kind of live sketching. Uh, you'll see this fence line in the background of these pictures. Um, this chair was just sitting out in the middle, and they had this large uh, Connect Four like yard uh, game. Uh, it really stares again. Um, the different angles of this picture, it's hard to differentiate them uh, just with the one color. Uh, I really like how those stir stairs turned out. Um, she's holding this flashlight at the top of the stairs so there's some like really white spice at the top. Um, I love how the planes go up, planes go back, and then you have this uh, staircase that comes over top of that doorway. And I completely screwed up that, <laughs> that uh, picture. Like, just threw in the towel and tried over again a little bit later. Uh, had it work out a lot better. Uh, again, it's with the popped hood. I'm trying to keep them all on the same plane and it's just not working out. This, though, is probably my favorite piece of the month. Uh, was this little shadowed um figure portrait contrast study. Uh, it took 10 minutes, kind of just nailed it out and just really fell in love with that. Uh, you have this pinup model, 10 minutes. Uh, I, I, for some reason I think her face study wasn't coming together just how I liked. Put a couple shadow lines in there and it looked a heck of a lot better. Uh, was about to scrap it like the car couple days before but stuck in there made it look how I wanted it to uh, then you have this other friend from Instagram uh, she was just sitting on a table I am trying to do more with hair so figured I'd throw that one in there uh, you have this Christina Scabia her hands coming out I figured I'd get two birds one stone I get a hand study in as well as that uh, almost tortured face look. Um, if you haven't checked out Lacuna Coil, you definitely should. One of my favorite bands. Uh, let's see here. Uh, another CBD 19 portrait study. Uh, getting better and better. Uh, Gunsmoke. You got Matt Dillon and now I can't think of her name. Uh, but I really like how these just the right lines made those figures turn out just how I wanted them to. Um, really enjoyed how that turned out. Uh, romance shot. A uh, guy leaning, kissing neck. 
uh, standing behind the lady. Uh, I really like how that turned out. Uh, Cleo Valentine uh, in her Batman shirt. Uh, messing with the ruffles more than anything, trying to get that to lay just correctly. Uh, I really like how that turned out. Berserker armor to almost nearly complete the uh, month I went through with blue pencil and kind of gave a rough figure sketch and then I drew the armor over all of that. Uh, really like how that turned out. I really wish it, you could see it a lot better. Uh, for this figure study, the face got really muddied in the smaller version so I kind of figured out the rest of the design and then came back and did her portrait study and really like how that portrait turned out to end the month. Uh, next month should be a heck of a lot of fun and I'll show you why because going into September I'm spending a month or a month for this month uh, I'm spending an hour working on figure studies which I'm doing two different studies a day 15 minutes a piece uh, and then I'm taking whichever one I like better and taking it to color uh, Barker sketch so look forward to that I'm sure you've seen this first one of CG19 uh, really like how that turned out and I'm loving the progress that I'm seeing in these sketches so hope you are too and we'll check in with you next month for these sketchbooks thank you